Good morning. It's great to see you again in intensive reading. You're with me, Mr. Suharno, the lecturer. Okay, class. In reading, there are cohesive devices which are essential for reader's comprehension. They refer to nouns like persons, objects, ideas, or situations. The devices are called reference words. Therefore, in this video, you are going to learn reference words. At the end of the lesson, you can apply your newly learned reference words for better comprehension. Okay, just follow me. Reference words are used to refer back to people, objects, ideas, or situations that have been mentioned earlier or will be mentioned later. There are three types of uh, reference words. Uh, the first is uh, determiner, yeah, like. Uh, the, this, that, these, and those. Yeah? And uh, the second is a pronoun, uh, like it, she, be, her, they, their, them, and so on, so forth. Yeah? And the third one is relative pronoun. Uh, like who, how, whose, whom, where, and when. Okay, everyone, let's see the example. This is a letter, but we cannot see from the beginning. Yeah. Well, please pay attention to the content of the letter. I'll read for you. Please apologize. Reader hasn't replied, just means email. Rina was busy with a lot of assignments from campus and also activities in BEM. At the same time, Rina had to take care of Rina's dad. Rina's dad was hospitalized for chronic hypertension. Rina was really sad when Rina wasn't allowed take grammar to examination. Mr. Rudy said Rina wasn't eligible for the test because Rina missed Mr. Rudy's class more than three times. Best regard, Rina. Okay, everyone. So, see here in the letter that Rina is used again and again many times. Well, uh, for us Indonesian, it is not a problem at all. But for non-Indonesian uh, speakers, this is a big problem. Yeah, this is a confusing for them. Yeah, they think there are many Rinas. Yeah, but act actually, Rina here is only one. That's the the writer of the letter. Okay. So what we have to do to eliminate the confusion? So we have to use reference. Yeah, we may not uh, use the same Rina again and again, but we have to change Rina with uh, reference words. Yeah. Okay, everyone, uh, this is uh, the new version and it is easy to understand. Let's have a look. Okay, let me read it for you. Dear Jasmine, please apologize. I haven't replied your email. I was busy with a lot of assignments from campus and also activities in BEM. At the same time, I had to take care of my dad. He was hospitalized for chronic hypertension. I was really sad when I wasn't allowed to take grammar to examination. Mr. Rudy said I was ineligible for the test because I missed his class more than three times. Best regard, Rina. Well, so what's the difference? In this new version, uh, 
Rina for the second time is replaced by the pronoun yeah I yeah. I means the writer of the letter I okay and uh, well here also he was hospitalized with chronic hypertension he uh, replaces dead yeah so dead is not repeated but it's replaced with the pronounced reference he yeah okay and then also mr rudy yeah is then for the second time replaced with his yeah his class it means mr rudy's mr rudy's class yeah okay and here the test we use the also as a reference coming from the article the test means the grammar examination so the test refers to grammar examination okay so it is easier than and it is uh, what is it not confusing for Okay, everyone, everyone let's, let's have, have a look, look at, at another, another uh, slide. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah. yeah. Let's, let's see, see here. here. Let's, let's move it for you. you. Like, like coral, coral ribs, sea anemones. Yeah, this is the non phrase. Sea anemones. With their, with flashy, their flashy tentacle like, -like college yeah. yeah this is the phrase this is the phrase uh, with, uh, with their, their flashy tentacle like, -like college okay in the middle, okay. In the middle there is, there is a, a pronoun reference there, there. yeah yeah so what does it, so mean, what does it there? mean there yeah, yeah. there there refers, refers to, to uh, possession possession yeah, yeah. so it refers so it refers to, to C anemone tentacles. Yeah. So, so there refers, refers to C anemone tentacles. tentacles yeah. and, and then another pronoun reference, so which, uh, which, which is, is a determiner, is that. That, yeah. Yeah. that, that refers, refers to polyps. Yeah. Polyps. Okay. Okay. Everyone. Everyone <clears throat> Uh, uh, there, there here is called, is called uh, uh, reference, reference, yeah? yeah? Reference. Okay. okay. Uh, meanwhile, uh, uh, the noun phrase here, here um, is, is called, called the antecedent, antecedent, yeah? yeah? And, and ante antecedent. Okay, okay, it's difficult, it's difficult to, write to write here, here yeah? yeah? Antecedent, yeah? yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, so once, once again, again, this is a uh, reference, and, and this is antecedent. antecedent. So antecedent, antecedent is the uh, noun or non phrase uh, to which, which the reference refers. refers. Okay, okay, let's, let's go, go on. on, let's go on, yeah? yeah? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> and uh, let's see, see other, other pronouns. Yeah. Yeah. Pronoun reference. reference. Okay. Okay. And then, and then type on here. here. Hmm. This. This. Yeah. Yeah. This. This. Okay. Okay. Pronoun, Pronoun reference usually, usually refer, refer to, to the antecedent, antecedent which, mostly which mostly comes before the reference, the reference itself. itself. So, so this, this refer refers to, to if you if read. You read also, also like, like coral, coral rising, rising water, water temperatures, temperatures associated with climate change, change can simply weaken this animals. This animal. So which animal? Here is it, it means a sea animal. Yeah. Yeah. Causing, causing them. Causing, causing who? Yeah. yeah. Of course, of course causing, causing the 
si animal. So this reference refer to the antecedent which at the beginning. Uh, see animals yeah. to, to expel the tiny uh, symbionts that, that keep, keep yeah. Yeah. So, so what, what keeps? keeps yeah the so tiny symbionts so it refers to tiny symbionts yeah. that keep them he also another alive and let them color a process known as Bleaching. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Lend, Lend them color. color. Sir? Sir? Mm, what, do what do you think? Up. Up. Distress. Distress. What does, what it, does it refer to? to? What do you what think? Do you think? Up, up this reference. What does, what it, what does it refer to? I believe, I believe you that you have the end. Okay, everyone, this is the last slide. And then let's see. Uh, the reference words on this slide. Let's, uh, let me read it for you. The following day, uh, which was cloudy and rainy, unfortunately. So we see which, and it is already bolded. So which is a relative pronoun. It refers to day. Yeah. So the reference which refers to the antecedent day okay let's go on we went to a museum where they have some dinosaur skeletons mm, where where here is uh, another relative uh, pronoun and it refers to the place museum yeah okay Go on, yeah. They have some dinosaur skeletons that local people, yeah. Okay, so here's another uh, pronoun, yeah, relative pronoun. It refers to dinosaur skeletons, yeah. yeah. Okay, dinosaur skeletons, yeah. Go on, local people have found in the area, yeah. The horrible uh, weather for a virtual day, so we visited a super seafood restaurant later in the afternoon and had an early dinner. The waiters, I'm sorry, the waiters were all dressed in traditional fishermen's clothes. We have who here? Yeah. Who it refers to people, waiters, yeah. Okay, let's go on. Were very friendly and told us about the history of the restaurant, whose name, yeah, whose name was the Jolly Roller, whose name means the the restaurant's name. The restaurant's name, yeah. The restaurant, which has been open since eighteen eighty eight, so we have another which it refers to the object, the restaurant. Yeah. Okay. Go on. Was visited by the American president John F. Kennedy and his wife Chicky. So everyone. You have uh, seen some examples from some slides, so probably have understood, yeah, the function of reference words, yeah. Don't forget uh, the keywords, yeah, reference words, referent, ante, antecedents, yeah. Okay, and then reference words, uh, devices, yeah. That uh, refer back to what has mentioned before, or <clears throat> sometimes it uh, refer to the future uh, things that will be mentioned yeah, by 
by the writer or by the speaker if it is in spoken language. Thank you.